In this shot, I, I've got an old Delta saw that I've had for like 20 years. So I modified the table to help cut things easier. So I began to insulate the outside. I'm using one and a half inch, um, sty uh, I don't know what they call it, foam, styrofoam. And um, so I insulated the whole outside with the inch and a half. Cut each piece to fit. Uh, nice and snug so there's no gaps. Pretty simple. I, I use my table saw to cut the uh, cut the foam. So it uh, had a nice straight cut. Fit pretty easy and very minimal waste. So any pieces that I had left over uh, I used in the tighter, tighter spots. So everything was uh, well insulated. And then I started uh, paneling the outside. So here is a shot of the back end looking forward, skinning the back first, doing the sides, and uh, a little shot of the top there. And then trimmed with a router on the top edge. Uh, the sides going up, and it was pretty square, so uh, I, was, <laughs> I was pretty happy that I didn't have to go through and trim a lot of edges. Uh, one side's completed, I believe the other side was finished, and then uh, the last part I had was the top, and then I saved the front for last. So here's the top uh, skin going on. I started in the back, working my way to the front, and then I began to, uh, I used a 16th inch paneling on the front to take that curve, so I didn't use quarter inch if anybody's at, you know wondering about that. So it went on pretty good. The bottom section uh, folded right around there, nice and easy. Um, I haven't trimmed the edges just yet. I'll save that for when I get ready to put on the uh, metal siding. And then I started on the, uh, the middle section and then I put the top on. And like I said, that top radius was just the right amount to take that curve any tighter and that wood would have just snapped right in half even though it's 16th inch and I do it I'll do it in two pieces so the uh, second piece I'll probably throw a hot towel on it or something just to sweat it a little bit take that bend a little bit easier and uh, probably use some glue in between uh, the contact cement so here's a shot this is uh, the stage it's at on the outside Everything is skinned, and um, I routed the windows on the sides, but I didn't do the front window just yet. I, I uh, waited until I was ready to start painting the interior. So that's that for this uh, part three. So stay tuned for part four, where we uh, start on the interior. Thanks for watching.